Lance and Christy. Join us as we build our dream. Welcome to Knight's Helm Farms. We're starting the panels. We did a bunch of research on this and it kind of seems like it's one of those things you just got to do. <laughs> just got to do it and figure it out. You ready for your microphone? Testing, testing. Caterpillar. Caterpillar you. I just don't really know where to put it. There. I'm gonna clip it to your beard. Yeah. I've seen people Hide do that. Hide it in my beard. Huh? Hide it in my Hide beard. Hide it in your beard. All right. You ready? Uh, yeah. So we have to pre-drill this and then screw it in. Yep. But you can't go real close to the edge because you got to do the H channel along the side. And so there won't be an H channel on the leading edge. Right. That'll, that'll just be covered with the fascia, I guess, right? I don't know. No, I think it's the other way around. Oh, there's gonna be a, an angle, actually. We'll have to put an angle on it. Yeah, we'll have to put an angle thing on there. We don't have the fascia on yet, but up here we're, what we're gonna do is just hold up a one by six, and he's got some clamps. And that way we can get the roofing out over the top of the fascia board yeah. when it, you know, we're gonna pretend it's there today, basically, with the scrap and some clamps yep scrap clamps yeah so that that first piece will be out over that fascia board that isn't there yet and then we'll put an l over the top and the side to hold everything together i just don't want the screw holes in the panel to be in the way of the angle that's going to go over the top right that's well. what i'm saying then they have to go further back. You're going to have to go in farther, yeah. But for now, let's get this part fixed. Yeah. For now, put that on there. One step at a time. So we're just putting it up there. No, we got to tape it first. Oh, yeah, we got to tape it. Got to tape the top and the bottom. We get, that means we got to peel this stuff back on both sides. Or just no, take just it off. Take it off, yeah. They're so pretty when they're new. Yep. And this is the UV side. I don't know why it's taking so long here. Why is this taking so long? Because we're being careful. There's one on this side too. Oh. Hang on. There we go. This stuff will be all over the yard before we're done. Right. All right, so we brought eight panels. Yes. And then figured with this heat, that's probably all we're gonna get done, because... We're already soaked through and we haven't truly started well, working. Well, at this point, it's more of a mind thing than it is a work thing. You gotta figure it out. We've been doing wood for so long. Okay, there's one panel taped. Climb the ladder and I'll hand it to you. Okay, bring it on over. Just setting it up there. Yeah, we gotta get our system figured out. How do you want it? Do you want it like this? I don't know. Oh. You're gonna have to go down further so you're on the next purlin. That's good, I think. The peak thing is gonna cover quite a bit. It's like four inches. Yeah, I'm already about two away from the end. Okay, I think that's good right there. Yeah, I should probably move this one down. Yeah. Do you want another one to grab the panel in a second place? 
Yeah. After you move that. There you go. Yeah, I don't see why that won't work. Just put two clamps on the panel and then two clamps with the one by sixes. And you look good up there. Yep. Yeah. Get this one down there and make sure it's good. Yeah. Yeah, and then I think you could start attaching it. Yeah. That's pretty neat. I like how that looks. You like that? Uh-huh. Look at that. Yeah, there it is right there. That is really cool. This is the discovery phase yes. <laughs> of the project. Like we're trying to figure it all out. But I think that's way smaller than I thought it was. I thought, okay. that they, I thought they were really big. So then we're actually gonna put them on there. We're gonna cut them, put on there horizontally to connect each of the uh, panels. Horizontally. Yeah. And then we'll put a long one along the side. Vertically. Yeah. Yeah. Like I said, we're just figuring it all out. Once we get it figured out and we get a system, it'll go fast. Yep. <sighs> Okay, so it looks like that's over everything. Yeah, and I like the length. I think it's good. It might actually be out farther on the top than it is on the bottom. Yeah, probably needs to go out a little further on the bottom. Okay. You got both drills? No. <sighs> you ready for this one? Sure doesn't take much to drill it, does it? Nope. Yeah, that trim is way smaller than I thought it was going to be, which is good. It is, but it does actually fit over this stuff. Yeah, it's made for it. That one's thicker too because it's still got the stuff on it. Okay. It'll go. What can I help you with? First one's done. I feel like I'm just standing here looking pretty. Uh-huh. So now I gotta run that channel up onto there. Yeah. And then I can screw down those sections. Yeah. And then gotta measure and cut another one to go across here. Yeah. And then I can put in the screws here. Yeah. So what do I need to do to help you? Oh. Or is this a one-man job? 
it's kind of a one-man job. I mean, should I go edit? Oh hell, I suppose you could. I mean, if that would work. Let's see, because I mean, short of just handing me pieces as we go. Other than that, the other thing you could do instead, I don't know, do you think you could tape by yourself? Or no? I could tape those three for you. Yeah. And then you're gonna come in and take a break. Okay. And then when you come back out, I can come back out and tape some more. Okay. Okay. Because the taping's the longest individual part of this job. Then I shall do it. But I'm not going to take all this film off. You're going to have to take the film off. Mm. All the way. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Ooh, those are hot. On our way up this morning with the panels, so we went back to the shop to get them. We stopped at the shipping container barn to see how this was holding up. And it's actually doing really good. So that was 22 when we did that. And it still looks good, so. Oh, there you go. You got a seat. Huh? I said, oh, there you go. You got a seat. Yeah. <sighs> that one's done. You want to go inside? Are you too hot? Okay. Hold on, I'll take you with me. <laughs> maybe they need to go on the deck. <laughs> or maybe they hear that smooching noise and they think you're calling them, I don't know. Inside. Hey. Hey, inside. <laughs> Get up there. Hurry up. The girls. <sighs> Is it going? <sighs> Not easily. I think that guy's idea with Dawn and Waters the way to go. Maybe just even water would work. You want a spray bottle? I guess. Okay. All right, I have a spray bottle that only has water in it. Yeah. Here you go. I got that on stream. <laughs> just like you. Uh. You're, you're dripping. <sighs> Nope. Water doesn't do anything to help. Okay. Ugh. Crap. You want the dish soap? Well, let me see where this H brace ends. Put some more screws in.
to get it? Hell no. Huh? No. Yeah, definitely gonna need the dish soap. Okay. I'll go grab you. Big old bottle, bucket. <laughs> bucket of dish soap. Do you want me to... Do you want it full strength or diluted? I would think somewhat diluted. You want to take a break? Sure. Okay. So I got those three taped up for you. All right, we're back to try the soap on the H bracket. Whatever that thing is called. It's called an H something. And then he's going to continue to put on panels. And I'm going to go inside and edit because it's kind of a one man job. So I'm going to put you on super speed. And he's not wearing the mic. And that way he can just work and not have to worry about anything. So tell me what you figured out. This whole structure needs to be run over with the tractor. <laughs> no. Oh, you got the second one up there. Well, yeah. That's all I've been working on the past six hours. Wow. Oh, wow. What can I do to help you? That it's bracket. It's nearly impossible to do. That bracket? Is it not on the bracket? Mm -hmm. All that it did. It made it easier, yeah, but it dried too damn fast and then it would slide in too far initially, pop right out. So the second panel popped out six or seven times on me. Then the H thing wouldn't stay, so I had to put a screw in there to keep it in place. Yeah. Yeah, it's, it's gonna take me a month just to do four panels. Is it cooler out here then? No? I don't know. I feel like it might be a little cooler than it was earlier. Well, maybe it needs to be 100% soap and not 50-50. You know what I mean? It looks like it's in there though, isn't it? Is it right right now? What do you mean? It's right now, right? Well, yeah. Okay. Well, I can't tell what you're screwing. It looks good. No. From my point of view, that it looks good. Freaking soap made me all disgusting and the panels are all disgusting now. Yeah. When it rains it'll be better. So don't use soap and then it works, right? Well I don't know what to do about it because without the soap I can't use a sledgehammer I'll damage it. Right. I keep pushing on it like crazy and I'm warping the H brace. just do four four panels today. I'll be lucky if I can get four done because this is the easy part. The two you got right now and then do two on this side just like it and put the crown on.
Is it on there? No. Mm, it's so hot. See, that's what I was running into, is it gets caught right there. Constantly, yeah. That's so why you have to slide it up. That's why I got this. <coughs> so you can get it on there just a little bit. All right, day one of putting in the polycarbonate panels was a train wreck. <laughs> to be nice about it, I'll say it was a train wreck. The H frame bracket, whatever it is, I don't know what you call that thing, is really, it's really a pain. I tried modifying it, there's really no way to do that. They say online to use a putty knife in here to make it bigger. That doesn't work, so I tried wood spatula. That doesn't work. This is very, very tight, and you cannot get the panel in there and make it stay. But we finally figured out that it is in fact a two-man job and we did use soap so the the panels are all grimy looking now but that's okay because it's just dish soap it'll rinse off and he has it all nice and lined up on the outside right here so that um, there's room for the fascia board it'll go out over the fascia board and then we can put an L trim on top like like that you know and right now he's putting on the peak the ridge cap so we're doing that in sections because as you go down then you're not going to be able to reach it so i'll go up top and show you what that looks like Yeah. <laughs> so he has the ridge cap on here. There's the two panels. I 
think it's going to look nice when it's done. On this side, there's two panels. So we, we got four panels. Well, he got four panels on. It wasn't all that much help. You helped with the last one. I helped with the last one. But there's it four kept panels. popping off because it's so long and it wouldn't <coughs> stay in the channel when I'm trying to push it. Yeah. Yeah, and I tried using other things. And like, I feel like my pads on my fingers are going to come off. But I, I'm sure I'll be fine tomorrow. I'm sure it will be. So, there's the two panels on that side. Ridge cap looks really good. And then he's got a few more screws here on this one. Down on that for one. But then we're pulling it a day. And we're gonna hit it really early. Early. <laughs> Before the sun comes up. Right? Essentially. Huh? Huh? What'd you say? Yeah. What did you say? I have it on film, I can go back and watch it. <laughs> So we're going to hit it really early, and I said with a semi. With a semi. No, we've come too far to give up now. Can't let polycarbonate win. So one screw there, and then what? Two on this side. Three down here? Uh, no, none down there. Right oh there, yeah, I guess that, so, huh? That one, yeah. Actually, six? I don't know. I don't know how many. More. There'll be more. All right, now I'm gonna try to get down. It's the underneath side of the ridge. <laughs> Ladder climbing with one hand because you have a camera in the other. A little dicey. Don't try this at home. <laughs> so, that's where we're going to leave it for today. Because at this point, all, all we're doing is a few more screws and then some cleanup. And we're going to call it a win because we got four panels on. And we learned a little something. Hire somebody. Hire somebody. Yeah, if only there was someone that did polycarbonate roofs. I don't think the walls would be so bad, but again, it's that connector piece that's the problem. So maybe the walls are going to be a pain too. I don't know. Oh, we'll see. So thanks for watching. We'll catch you on the next one. Bye. Bye.